Hello everybody, my name is Sam and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to set up your very own Discord server for you and your friends. So, when you first start off with a server, this is what you usually get. And it looks it looks all right. You've got a you got a, a, a text channel and a voice channel. But this just isn't good enough. So, to improve this, what we're going to do is click on the create channel button above here. And we're just going to make a welcome channel. Boom. So then we, what we're going to do is right click it. We're going to create a new category and call this probably just welcome. And now we're just going to drag that to the top. And put welcome under there. Now after you've created a welcome channel, pretty much you can either go into server settings and go to overview and scroll down and enable this which sends a random welcome message when somebody joins the server or you can disable all of these or keep some on as you wish and oh, also you can click on this which show boost progress bar and that pretty much just shows a boost progress bar for how far you are into your boosts so or what you can do is you can go to Dinobot and I find this really useful, it's a really good bot and once you're on this page you want to click on add the server and then scroll down to the free plan, click on add the server and obviously it will make you log in so make sure you have the right server then click continue and you can change all of these as you wish but I'm fine with these, so let's click on authorize. And then it might come up with a little human thing, so just click this box. And here we are, we are now in Dino. So, pretty much just go through all of this. So, choose your updates channel. So, for this, we're going to head back to our Discord server. And click on this little plus button once more. Oh no, not that one. I'm going to click on this one and we're going to make one called announcements. So now once you have this channel called announcements, you can either put that in a new category, which is called important. Or you can just keep it under tag channels, whatever you prefer. So we're going to put this under welcome. Then we're going to drag that down. And in announcements, pretty much all of your server updates and announcements will be held in here. So, let me quickly refresh the page so it comes through. Okay. So yeah, just, uh, there we go. Perfect. So, now what we're going to do is go into modules and basically scroll down and until you find welcome, click on welcome, and you can choose any of these. I'm going to choose message and select the welcome channel. So you can you can change this message however you want. So I'm just going to keep it simple and say this. User just joined the server. Have a great time. Click on update. And when this box comes up, that means it's worked. So that should now be that should now be um, up and running. So let's head back to Discord. And this is completely optional, but um, what I like to do is just to organize my server a bit is to add some roles. So we're going to click on roles here, and we're going to click on create role. And of course, we're going to make one called owner. And you can choose your you can choose in your own color. My, my personal favourite colour is lime green, so we're going to do that. And you want to you want to make sure it's below all your bots. Next, we're going to add a bot role for Dino. So we're going to call this bot. And maybe just possibly, yeah, we'll just make this a light blue. And then we're going to add a member role for new people who join us. There we go. So we already have five roles set up. So now what we're going to do 
is simply go to permissions on member and you can edit these to your satisfaction but i'm going to click on view channels create invite send messages add reactions read message history connect speak video Use activities, use soundboard, use external sounds, use voice activity. And that is it. So we're going to click on save changes. And now we're going to go to owner. And we're just going to tick all of these permissions for owner. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. There we go. So once we're done with that, we can exit this. And now we have our um, our welcome channel, our announcements channel, our general chat and general VC. So what I'm going to do for announcements, so what I'm going to do first is go to edit channel for welcome, go to permissions and click on advanced permissions. Then we want to scroll down to member, click on this. And I'm going to make it so they can view the channel, but they can't they can't edit it in any way. So really they can't do anything except see the message history. There we go. And we're also going to do the same for announcements. Now for general, we're going to also put some permissions up. We're going to go to member, we're going to view the channel, take off most of these, send messages, take off all of these, add reactions, use it some emojis. Yes, no, no, no. Perfect. So we already have a bot rolls working welcome system and also some more channels so what we're going to do is we're going to head back into our bot here i'm going to go to modules and we're going to go to auto roles and pretty much what we're going to do is click on this click on member and we're going to add role and when they join the server people will automatically get this role So, now your server is pretty much set up. So, what you can do, this is completely optional, but I like to add some emojis to my channels. So, we're going to do that. Welcome. Announcements. It's going to be a megaphone. General chat. It's just going to be a speech bubble. And general VC is just going to be a speaker with two with medium. There we go. Now your server is pretty much set up, and all you need to do now is give yourself the owner role and give Dino a bot role. Perfect. Now your server set up, then you can invite some friends. And this is optional too, but if you wanted to, just to spice up your server a little bit, you can also change the server icon and rename it, which is what I'm going to do right now. Perfect. Now your server is completely finished. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, 
please make sure to check out some of my other ones and also make sure to like and subscribe because we are trying to reach 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year so I can do a setup for you all. So please make that possible by subscribing. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Until then, peace out.